What up, YouTube? It's your boy, Darius. I want to thank you guys for watching. You guys could be anywhere else in the world, but you're here with me, and I really appreciate that. Make sure you subscribe to your boy. Leave a like. If you guys have any recommendation, leave in the comment section, and I'll get to it as soon as possible. What we're about to do right now, but we have to Coco Roco Abusey Johnson. We out here. Um, actually, I saw this on a recommendation. Like, I think this song came out in 2018. It got 40 million views, y'all. 40 million. And yet, this is my first time ever hearing this. You know what I'm saying? I never heard this song before. You know what I'm saying? So, um, you know what I'm saying? I was listening to some music like, you know, Quantic, um, Time is Our Enemy. It was just a dope song, by the way. But no bow, um, Silver. And I figured, you know, this song might be related to, like, you know, probably the one of those trip-hop songs. Again, I never hear, I never listened to this song before. I saw it. It had 40 million views, so enough of me, blah, blah, blah. Let's get to it. See if it's all real. Hmm. The guitar had that little indie sound, like, like that's something you can hear in, like, in a coffee shop. Hey, let me tell you the truth. We got a little fox right there walking. Mm. Mm. That little, that little drum sound. Like, like definitely at that groovy like drum sound, something that you can find along to the music. How long is this song? Seven minutes, right? The music definitely quiet and not loud. Mm. Mm. That little horn sound. You know what this? It this sound like jazz mixed with indie rock. I never thought. I never thought something like that would ever happen, but. Hey, you know, like, hey, you know, like, this is, uh, music, you know what I'm saying? You never, you never know what type of music that is out there. It, this is so good. It's, it's really quiet, like, I don't want to say quiet, but it's really mellow. Like, it's something that you listen to after a hard day at work or after you're out, out, out doing errands. You know, you come back, you know, you just want to relax. Relax in your apartment. You know, you just chill, like, with, with the window open. And you just smoke, and you just smoke a little blunt. I don't smoke. You know what I'm saying? But that's how I perceive it. Mm. De definitely had that um, jazz, really indie rock feel to it. This is really, this is really chill, y'all. It's chill mixed with jazz and mixed with indie, indie rock. I can hear a little seventies music um, in it too, like something that maybe Steely Dan would.
Mmm. It's definitely very quiet, very mellow too. You know, I would actually, I would actually add like some vocals to it too, like maybe a female lead. You know what I'm saying? And, oh, I love the horns too. This is like jazz fusion. That's what it is, jazz fusion. Like something Miles Davis would do, like in Bishop Brew. So you can hear a little Congo something. Something you hear like in the old 70s music. Like in a war song. Really, really good, y'all. It's just very quiet. That's what it is. Like I'm, I'm more like a loud type of person, but, oh, I did not saw this coming. Uh, hello, five, five and a half minutes until the focus came in. Love the guitar too. It's really mellow right there. And not heavy. I get that I get that was the point. It's not meant to be heavy. It's just meant to be like cool. You know what I'm saying? It's probably Afrobeat. I think what that that's what this is, Afrobeat. You know what I'm saying? This is really a good song. I liked it. I think that this is a really good song, y'all. Um, you know what I'm saying? It had that cool 70s sound mixed with a modern indie um aesthetic. You know what I'm saying? Mixed with that jazzy, you know, jazzy feel to it. This is definitely a really, really great song. I can pick, like I said, I can picture this song. Like, you know, you come off of work or you come off from, like, uh, vacation. And you just chilling on your bed with the window open. And you just smoke, smoke a blunt or two. That's how I picture it. What do you guys think of this particular song? Let me know. Comment down below. Leave a like, subscribe to your boy. You can check out our previous uh, video down here. Peace, love, and rock and roll.